So, hello people, how you going today? And today I am going to show you the banknotes of Zambia that were issued between 1980 and 1988. So these are about mm, 29 to uh, 37 years old. Now the issue I have here is the last signature of each of them. And, well, inflation took off at this time, so it's not, I'm not surprised that Actually, a lot of these banknotes were kept. Now, the first thing you know about all Zambian banknotes is that each denomination has a different letter, and this never changes on every issue. So, while well, the numbers change, so this is 67 million. All banknotes have of the one kwacha have the letter A. The two have the letter B. The five have the letter C. The uh, 10 have a letter D, the 20 have a letter E, and 50 have the letter F. Now, current banknotes that are currently used uh, since uh, 2013, the 2 kwacha starts with A, and the 100 kwacha would have uh, the letter F. Now, these banknotes have uh, the fish eagle, which is also the used as a symbol of Zimbabwe and Malawi. And it has a coat of arms with the fish eagle up top. And uh, the motto of one Zambia, one nation down below. And it has uh, uh, Kenneth Kwanda, who used to be president of uh, Zambia until about 1991. And he was practically a dictator, so this is a normal issue for um, a dictator put their face, oh look, I'm a dictator, oh, I'm so cool, I am the best. But oh, I read somewhere, no, I watched it on YouTube where someone said, oh, they interviewed Muhammad Gaddafi. And they were just saying, all dictators are boring because they just think that they're eating a bit. Anyway, that's my rant. In the middle, we have a native plant that is in Zambia, but I'm not too sure what these plants are. It doesn't have a name on them, and I can't actually find any information anywhere. Okay, up here has a security feature, it has five and zero, represent 50, and the um, watermark is a person, just a generic Zambian. Okay. On the reverse. So anyway, so that is the same with all Zambian banknotes. They've um of this issue, they have all, this, all uh, these features on it. it. Has a security thread. Okay, the reverse image is all different. So this is the independence monument that's in the one um, Lusaka, which is the capital. And on here we have uh, the National Assembly building, which is um. In the sucker as well. See, the printer is down. Oh, not print. The printer is down below. Okay, so this uh, 50 kwacha was issued in 1986. All the rest were issued in uh, 1980. Okay, the 20 kwacha has um, maize or tapico. It looks like maize actually. So, and a female carrying some produce. Okay, the 10 has the uh, the Bank of Zambia building in Lusaka. The five has uh, the Kariba Dam. Okay, so it's good. And here is another feature that doesn't go on the back. So that is uh, a bird, a fish, a traditional mask. Okay, the two kwacha has education, so it has a school building and a female teacher instructing a male student. And the one kwacha is um, is a cotton harvesting, so this is a cotton plant here, and here's a cotton in the bag. And this banknote was replaced by a coin in about I think 1987 of one kwacha. So, 
these are pretty easy to get on eBay. The, the hardest one I found to get was actually the 20 Kwacha. It's probably a bit, bit more expensive than the 50. Maybe it's just the way I brought it. So the flowers, this one has a nice red flower and green on the back. Uh, this flower here, yellow. On the five, has like a, a flower, looks like an, some type of a tree, probably an acacia. And this one is in sequence. It says five banknotes, uh, numbered one to five, the last serial number. And the same with the ten kwacha. And this one has a, uh, looks like it might be a type of hibiscus flower. And that, so that will be a tree. And the 20 has a uh, yellow flower, beautiful. And as I said, the 50 has purple flowers, beautiful. So those are banknotes of Zambia. The issue afterwards was uh, not that good. But the issue from 1992 onwards was probably the best issue Zambia's ever issued. Okay, so thank you very much for watching. I'll put a link down below, an affiliate link, if you'd like to... Um, purchase any of these banknotes they're pretty cheap to get and they'll actually make a good collection so thank you very much for watching and have an awesome day